Okay, so we are getting ready to redo the garage, and as you can tell, it's a freaking mess. <laughs> So we did pick up some cabinets, so to be fair, these were not always there. That's a new addition. But currently it's like we've got camping gear. Uh, I don't even, what is that even too? What? This, is this for the dryer? No, that was for the vent in the bathroom. Oh. It's just excess. Excess, <laughs> just excess shit. Um, stuff over here. Um, but just like all of this stuff needs to be sorted through. As you can see, we've just got a lot of shit. So we're gonna be going through it all today. The goal is to get everything out of here. We did buy an epoxy garage flooring kit, so we're it's going right to there. be redoing our, huh? The kit's right there. Oh, I was like, I said there's a spider on me. Um, so we're gonna be putting this on the floor. That'll be in a separate video on all the details there. But yeah, we've got some, some fun stuff. So let's get busy and do some of this work. let it dry out overnight and then come out tomorrow morning and start the application. Okay, so it is day two of our garage project. So what we did last night was got it all cleaned out, degreased the floor, cleaned it really well, let it dry out this morning. And now we are getting ready to do the etching solution. I had to remember the name. So we're going to etch the, the flooring and get it all cleaned up and then we're going to keep moving forward. So tonight we're officially going to put down the epoxy coat. So let's get busy. So what we've found is that it's super, super thin, which feels kind of off, but I guess it's normal. So we're gonna make, mix up the second batch and yeah, be done. pegboard and I've got my two strips and I just have to attach the pegboard to the strips. So it should be pretty easy. <laughs> <laughs> 